a solution as a solvent and a solute as its components. But what are solvents and solutes? A solvent is a component that dissolves other components in it. For example, water can dissolve sugar and salt in it, hence it is a solvent. On the other hand, a solute is the component that is dissolved in the solvent. For example, salt and sugar dissolve in water. Hence, they are solute. Anyone who has made tea or coffee knows that giving too much tea leaves and coffee powder results in a strong flavor, highly concentrated drink. Whereas, too little results in a beverage which is dilute and might be unsuitable to drink. We will discuss the concentration of a solution based on the comparative quantity of solvent and solute present in the solution. The concentration of a solution is the amount of solute present in a given amount of the solution. The quantity may be calculated in terms of mass or volume. There are various ways to express the concentration of a solution. We will learn two methods to do this. Number one, mass by mass percentage and number two, mass by volume percentage. The concentration of a solution in terms of mass by mass percentage is calculated as mass of the solute divided by the mass of the solution and then multiplied by 100. For example, if a solution contains 30 grams of common salt and 320 grams of water, then according to the mass by mass percentage formula, the mass of the solute is 40 grams and the mass of the solution is the mass of the solute plus the mass of the solvent giving total mass of 360 grams. Hence, 40 grams divided by 360 grams multiplied by 100 will give 11.1% of concentration. The concentration of a solution in terms of mass by volume percentage is calculated as mass of the solute divided by the volume of the solution and then multiply by 100. For example, if a solution contains 50 gram of sodium chloride and 1 liter of water, then according to the mass by volume percentage formula, the mass of the solute is 50 grams and the volume of the solution is 1 liter or 1000 milliliter. Hence, 50 grams divided by 1000 milliliters multiplied by 100 will give 5% of concentration.